Howdy folks, this is Checkers back again with another episode of Morris Goes to Oblivion. This time with episode 5. And I need to mention that I actually just did this entire episode, but I lost the vast majority of it when the sound basically... I don't even know how to describe it. It was like somebody threw it into a jet turbine. Like the microphone. I don't know what happened. I hope that it won't be a consistent thing, as that might be a bigger problem. I don't think it was just the uh, microphone, but it's hard to say. It was really strange. Anyway, I will turn it over now to Morris the High Elf, who doesn't really sound all that much different, and let him continue his journey. Okay, so we have an earned ourselves a recommendation from Anvil, is it? Let's head on down the line. Valenwood is not going to help us at the moment. Skingrad we've already done, as I recall, so we shall brave Bravil. Now, from what I recollect, it is, yes, yes, a rustic town would be the kind way to say it. Haphazard. Slapdash. Mm. Ramshackle maybe? I don't know. What on earth? We've heard something apparently and found ourselves a topic. A warlock's luck. However, we don't need a warlock's luck. For those who may have followed the exploits of a certain legendary Khajiit, especially those involving the Night Mother, you might find a familiar face. Well, if she still had one. Oh, well, that's not going anywhere. Yes, that's the statue of the Night Mother, just as it was in my history books. Okay. For those who may be joining us for the first time, Morris here started out in Skyrim, but through some unusual circumstances came to Cyrodiil during the Oblivion Crisis. So. Hi there. Hi. Uh, hello there. Hello. Do you know who the um, boss is? I'm Ardalin. Okay. I'm the guild's advanced trainer in alchemy here in Brazil. Uh huh. Okay. Well, you don't seem to know anything about recommendations. Yeah, well. So, our athletic skill has just increased as we dash about Cyrodiil, just trying to get into. The Mage's College. I wonder if it's ever occurred to the Mage's Guild that having one key for every single structure might not be the best idea. Okay, anyway. Hello. Hello there, Associate. You're here for a recommendation, I presume. Ooh, Are you prepared to earn it? What have you got in mind? I'm ready. I'm afraid I haven't had time to prepare anything conventional. I'm very preoccupied with this situation concerning Ardalin. Okay. Perhaps you can help with that, however. I can't directly get involved for fear of embarrassing the poor girl. Uh-huh. I'll need you to have a little chat with Varen Vamori, and you can learn something about the power of illusion in the process. Illusion. Okay. Um... Varen Vamori, you say? I don't understand it. Some ridiculous male thing, I suppose. He's been bothering Ardeline every day for a while now. Uh-huh. He even stole her mage's staff. What? Perhaps he thinks it's amusing. I don't know. But it needs to stop. It's making her miserable. So you want me to beat him to death with the staff? Is that what you're getting at? It's more symbolic than practical, but each carries great significance to its owner. You're going to get Ardeline's staff back. Okay. Take this charm scroll. With it, you should find Varon more receptive to questioning. Don't come back without that staff. 
So I wrap the staff in the scroll and then beat him? Okay. Well. Beguile sure was Baron added. Hands over that staff. Okay. Hmm. Apples. A less rude song. Crystal ball. Five gold. I will take your five gold. And... Head Reasons. back downstairs. Hello. Another silver dagger. Hmm. I'm... I know this is crazy, but I'm overloaded at the moment. So... We should probably just try and stay on task here. And we should definitely... Switch bells. Okay. Mm, door's locked. Huh. Okay. Part of the house is leaning. I guess we could just wait out here for a while and see if it falls down. Oh, let's try six hours. Let's see how that goes. Oh, you know what? I should have just spent some time playing with our conjuration spell. Like that. Oh, yeah. Okay. Hey, it's open. Hey there, sunshine. Can I help you? Well, let's find out. Let's... Give you some pie first. Uh-huh. So, I would say these are our happy ones, those are our unhappy ones. Don't, yeah. Don't talk such rot. Uh-huh, whatever. What? Not that. Don't talk such rot. Don't, okay. What? Sure. I doubt it. Oh, bribe. Mm. Well, you know, we did have where on earth oh 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 let's give that a whirl shall we good day hi hello friend what can i do for you you can have a lovely green halo and you are doing a fabulous job tell me about ardeline i don't know what to say all I want is for her to care about me, to feel the same way as I do about her. But she doesn't. Then you blame her? I try and I try, and it just doesn't matter. It makes me furious sometimes. Huh, yeah. And about her staff. All right, I admit it. I took it from her. I, I don't know what I was thinking, honestly. I was trying to tell her how I feel, again, and she wouldn't even stop to talk to me. I just got so angry. I was a little ashamed afterwards, but I didn't know how to apologize or give it back. I wish I could. I'm afraid I don't have it anymore, you see. I... I sold it to a friend of mine, Saurus Aranum. You are not the sharpest knife in the drawer, are you? So let me get this straight. You like this woman, and your solution is to stalk her and then steal one of her items and sell it for profit. You really need to work on your game, man. Okay, anyway, tell me about Soros Renim. He lives in the Talos Plaza district of the Imperial City. He's the one who has Ardeline's staff now. Why? You had the time to go to the Imperial City to sell the staff? You really are a special bunny. Okay, well... Alright, what is this? Pay attention, and you can Speechcraft, learn Speechcraft, huh? Lot. Yeah, no thanks. You don't seem Tell to know it very well. Oh yeah, I'm sure she'll be fascinated. She probably want to know why I didn't beat you with the staff. Okay, so... Let's get on over to the Mage's Guild. And 
Hey, there we go. Hey, Have boss. Any luck talking with Varen Vermor yet? It should be no trouble at all once you use that scroll. I did. And, well... He sold it, huh? Yeah. Well, this just keeps getting worse. Yeah. Very well. I presume he gave you some indication of where the staff is now located? Well... Take these and go resolve the situation. All right. And, of course, please keep this just between us. You got it. Off we go. Three beguiles added, huh? Get that well. staff back, associate. Okay. Off like a herd of high elf. Let's see what we've got. Why does it keep switching to... <sighs> Heavy sigh. Okay. Um. No. We want this. We want this. Several more scrolls. Find Asaurus Arenim in the Imperial City. Talos Plaza District. Okay. Hey, well, you know, my shoes are a bit scuffed. Can I borrow your helmet? That brush looks like it'd be mighty fine at cleaning them up. Ooh. These Imperial Guards, no sense of humor, huh? You have my ear, citizen. Well, if I did, I'd give it back because honestly, I wouldn't want it. Hey, look at that. Not even locked. Hello. Hello. Good day, stranger. Saurus Aranin is my name. Well, that's that's lovely. Let's see what this we can do. Be good. Stuffing some pie into your face, sunshine. Okay, so these are our good ones, these are the bad the ones. Uh, <laughs> blah blah blah. What a bore. <laughs> your I won't fight you. Well, that's You're relatively down. smart. You, I like that a lot. Okay. <laughs> what? You're, I, I can't argue with that. Fifty-three, huh? Um. Well. Let's see. Oh, whoops. What do you want? Um. Well, I want a major staff. As much as I like you, friend, I'm just not willing to part with that staff. It's nothing personal. Oh. Okay, well, I'm not really necessarily Bye. willing to part with my charm scrolls yet. So why don't I just, um, slip right on up here? Nobody's following me. Let's take a look at what you got upstairs. No, nothing there. What you got in the bag? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Lockpick, we'll be taking that. Well, staff wouldn't fit in there. Okay, venison. Sweet roll. Oh, I'm over encumbered. Uh oh. Um, well. Well, that's gonna make things difficult, isn't it? Let's see. Sweet roll. Oh, they still taste better stolen. Okay, let's have some apples then. Um,. Hmm. We, we can carry exactly one unit of weight. Wait, do we know what they're called? No. We can carry one feather. Source Arenim's key. And we can take that. And um, let's head right on down here. And... Hello! How goes it? Well, you know... It would go a lot How better. Goes? If I could get you away from that door. Hi. Why don't we try just kind of nudging you. There we go. Nudge. 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 How goes Very manly the way you let me nudge you like that. Okay. Let's uh, slip down here. See what we can find. Nobody's chasing me. Okay. I need to figure out what on earth I can drop. Um, wait, no, nothing looks super, wait, 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 manual of armor, does that tell us anything? Now, I'm not as familiar with the skill books. Wait, 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 chest, one gold, we'll take that. Drawer's hard, I don't know if I can crack, ah, ha, 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 opened the container with a key, mage's staff, weight zero, 
Oh, the perfect staff. I've stolen the staff from Soros RNM's house. I need to deliver it to Kadai in Braville. Hmm. A sack full of grainy things. Hello. Oh, hello. What's your I'm problem? I'm sorry, Aranim. Soros is my husband. Uh huh. All well, right. Forty-six. Let's cheer you up. Uh, you like that one, huh? You like these two? Okay. Well, you know. I won't fight you. I. I don't try to manipulate me. I don't. You. I like that a lot. Okay. You, that's not now. Not later. Goodbye. Uh huh. Well. There we go. And now, we just press that old space time key and we are going to Braville. Okay. I'm listening. Okay, that's good to know. Let's whip into oh the fight not the fighters guild. There must be a store around here. The fair deal. Well, let's see if we can actually get one. Maybe we've got something we can sell. You don't look like a shop. You look like a bar. But you okay. always get a fair deal here. I'm Nilowin. What can I get you? I don't know. What can you get me? First, let's yes. feed you some pie. Well, you're maxed. So Have a look let's at my see. Wings. Uh huh. Let's haggle just a bit, and let's see what I can do for you. Sweet. Let's see if we can't nudge another point out of her. Blue velvet. Okay, fur boots, fur cuirass, fur gauntlets, fine fur greaves. Oh, I kind of want to keep those. But you know what? This is taking up 30. Let's get rid of that. And I don't even want those, so you can have those. Anything over here? Mort flesh. I'm pretty sure we can find more if we really need it. That's a fair deal. Uh, all right. 11 week healing. I hate to sell healing potions though. Okay. Mm, none of this has really any weight. Alright, well, let's see Tell what we got down to. Me. Okay, I will probably never do that, but. Well, we got some weight back. Bye. 47 feathers. Okay. Well met. He is really strong. Look how many feathers he can carry. Oh wait. Anyway, um Hi. Mars is an excellent healer. But I understand. Alright. Just gonna stand over there in the weeds, huh? Right on. Okay. Greetings, Breton. Nazi at the Fighters Guild seems very at peace Hi. with himself. Hi! Do you have the Mage's Staff Associate? I do. I do indeed. Ah, wonderful. I shall be most pleased to return this to its rightful owner. Thank you. You are more you than welcome. You tell me the details of what was involved in getting it. It's perhaps better that I know nothing about it. Hmm, maybe. Your actions for the Guild more than merit a recommendation. I shall send it to the University promptly. Excellent. And to thank you more personally, I shall teach you this spell. You may find it useful in certain circumstances. Okay. And captivate. Thank you very much. I have spoken desperate to need of help, and I think you are the only one that I can I turn to. I'm wow, okay, this is just too much all at once. We're out of here. Okay. I mean I know I'm 
the most charming high elf you've ever met, but you can all just tone it down, tone it down. We need to find another city. Another city to lay when it is to find another recommendation. Well, well, a bit stormy. Kind of like that. Five Claws Lodge, but we can probably find shelter in the Mage's Guild here. However, however, we need to get there. And as I recall, the Mage's Guild is over yonder. See, studying pays off. Blackwood Company. Company what? Company Hall. Okay, and into the Mage's Guild we go. A new guild for fighters. Greetings, ah. High Elf. Hello. Yes, is there something I can help you with, Associate? Well, can you write me a recommendation? Ah, yes. I'm afraid I'm unable to issue a recommendation. Only DeGail can do that. Okay. You may try to speak to her. If... If it doesn't go well, come see me. Okay. Ooh. I offer the finest goods and the lowest prices in all Cyrodiil. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I don't have any kind of money to deal with you, but... Farewell. Somebody back here? Hello, associate. Alves. Alves. Uvenim? How goes it? And Kelthar. Wow, you are... You are just a... Creepy looking dude. Okay, so, anyway. How goes it? It goes up the stairs, apparently, to see if we can find... What did you say her name was? Dagale? You Gale. seek wisdom from me, child? Ah, no, you seek words. Yes? Words are difficult. They come and go. The voices, though, so loud they are, they drown out the words. Uh-huh. Without my amulet, my stone to lock the voices away, the words will never come and stay. Would you lift your hands to help another? To help me find the words? I can try. Then seek Agatha, child. She will see the path and set you on it. I must rest. Okay. Well, thank you. Farewell, child. Yep. Fare thee well, DeGale. Yes? Is there something I can help you with, Associate? Yeah? You remember telling me about DeGale? She's led such a troubled life. I just do what I can to make it easier on her. Okay. Well, she told me, I think, about something called the Seer I'm Stone. I'm surprised she discussed it with you. She wanted to keep it from the others. I should speak to her about that. Yes, her Seer Stone is missing. It's the one thing that has kept her visions at bay. And without it, they're nearly crippling. She hmm. can't function. We haven't yet spoken to the others, for fear they would be less than accepting of her situation. Perhaps it is time, though. I will continue to tend to DeGale. Can you speak with the other mages and find out if any of them have seen the stone? Um, okay. For you? Of course. Well, let's give it a whirl. Happy, less happy, more happy, less happy. So these are the unhappy ones? Don't. I so and I won't the happier fight ones. You. Well, not too much, but a little bit. Good day. Okay, there were people back here. Hello, Associate. Hello, Alves. Nice to meet you. Um, do you know anything about a seer's All stone? All I heard was that it was important to Dagao, and it was missing. Kalthar didn't tell me anything more than that. Kalthar, huh? Okay. Well, all your travels be safe. Kalthar. Of course it would be the creepy looking dude. Hey, Kalthar, what? come here. Oh, yeah. Did you, uh, did you burn those eyebrows off or? Never mind. 
Uh, do you know anything about De Gale's seer stone? Well, well. Word is finally spreading, is it? They won't be able to keep up this facade much longer. Yeah, I know all about it. I overheard Agata and De Gale talking. And you know what? I'm glad it's gone. Why should we be forced to work under someone who's only kept sane by a magical trinket? Haven't we sacrificed enough already? She shouldn't even be here anymore. Hell, the only reason her father ever fit in anywhere is because he kept a low profile. And look what it got him. Oh, boy. Years of service to the Empire, and not even a tombstone over his head. Huh. At least he was able to maintain the illusion of sanity. I know. I get way too fired up over this. It just annoys me that she's in charge of the guild when she's clearly not fit. That's all. Great. Great. Goodbye. Yeah, you're not suspicious at all. Yes. Hello. Is there something I can help you with, associate? Do you know anything about this dude? Cause he is not cool. So Calthar overheard us, did he? That explains why he's been so cranky lately. Uh huh. But we never said anything about DeGale's father. How would he know anything about that? If there's some sort of connection between the Seer Stone and DeGale's father, I don't know about it. Maybe if you ask her, it will jog her memory. Okay. Well. In the meantime, I'll keep an eye on Calthar. And I'll go take DeGale's memory out for a jog. You too. What is it, associate? Hey, Sudrasa. Have you seen De Gale? She's probably in here somewhere. Uh, but not in here. And not in here. Okay, well. Not that way. Not in here, nor in here. What is that? Hand bill. Okay, well, let's see what the hand bill is. Out of curiosity, let the three sisters hunt for you. After your meal, try one of our soft beds for the night. Locks and keys are available for a small fee. Charming. Okay, well, let's get on the prowl for De Gale as we have a memory to take on a jog. Okay, well... Um... Well... Unless she's hiding under the bed or inside her cupboard. Okay, she said she was going for a rest. I don't feel like it was that long ago, but... Here you are, of course. You seek more from me, child? It is as I have seen. Okay. I know what you would ask. You would bring light to that which is in darkness, bring silence to the voices so loud. I know where you must go. Okay. Blood ran blue and dragons flew high. Under broken towers and broken bodies it now lies, waiting to be found. What was my sire's must be mine, if you would have the words you seek. You must go and find his stone. Okay then, I will work on that. Good to know. Did you actually give me anything I must know? Need to find the fort at which DeGale's father... Fort Blue Blood it is! Hello, associate. Off like a herd of high elf, and into the storm we go. Well, you know... Um... Hmm. All right. Well, you know what? I think we will pause here in the rain and the thunder and the lightning and everything frightening. And I will turn it over to checkers. Uh -huh. Alrighty. So we are on the hunt for a seer's stone for DeGale. And we will head over to Fort Blue Blood. Was that what its name was? Fort Blue Blood when next we meet. For the moment, I would like to say thank you for watching. I hope you found the video entertaining and maybe just a little informative. I would like to invite you to subscribe. 
like and to share if you so desire, and to ask you, above all, to please take care.